Welcome to Then and Now, Grammys edition. I'm Asha Dyer, coming to you from the American Beauty Star Studio in West Hollywood, California. At this year's 60th annual Grammy Awards, stars showed up and showed out on the red carpet, but one queen stood out to us the most. I think you know who we're talking about, the Queen Bee. With Beyonce being one of the biggest beauty icons of all time, we thought it'd be fun to take a look at her journey on the red carpet, from her early days in Destiny's Child to present day. Taking it all the way back to 2000, Beyonce hit the red carpet at the age of 18 with Destiny's Child, giving us blonde bombshell vibes. It's crazy to think that at the age of 18, Beyonce was already a standout hit on the red carpet. And what a difference a year can make. In 2001, Destiny's Child took home two awards for their hit album Survivor, and Beyonce started to be seen as a standout performer. This year, she went for a sleek and sexy vibe with bone straight hair and a smoky eye. The star was definitely on the rise. And of course, we have to give cred to her mom, Tina Knowles, who used to style her daughter and the DC girls back in the early days. Now, here's where it gets interesting. In 2004, Beyonce made her first appearance at the Grammys as a solo artist. Her debut album, Dangerously In Love, racked up five Grammys this year, confirming her place among the stars. Now check out her look here. She's got the all gold look going on. I have a feeling she knew she was gonna win big because she matches with the Grammys that she's holding. In 2005, B hit the Grammys red carpet with Jay-Z, showing the world that she was crazy in love with this romantic updo and natural makeup look. She also took home a Grammy for her performance of So Amazing with Stevie Wonder. This look is a little different from the others because it proves that she can pull off the crazy music looks, but also the elegant, sleek looks on the red carpet as well. Jumping ahead a few years to 2007, Beyonce amazed us all with her performance in the movie Dreamgirls. She took the stage this year singing the movie's hit song, Listen, and channeling Billie Holiday with this wavy Hollywood glam look. Not only did she wow us on the stage, but also with her outfit on the red carpet. In 2008, Beyonce rocked the Grammy stage with the legend Tina Turner in the duet of Proud Mary. This year, Beyonce surprised us all with a lob cut, giving the queen a fresh look on the carpet and securing her role as a future beauty icon. I also think she was kind of channeling early Tina Turner on the stage here, and it definitely worked. In 2010, Bee snatched up six Grammys with her groundbreaking album, I Am Sasha Fierce. Her look was equally as groundbreaking as she stepped into her alter ego, Sasha, with a defined crease smoky eye and bone straight hair, adding to the fierceness. Clearly, Beyonce is someone who knows how to wear outfits that flatter her body and looks that flatter her features, making her a standout no matter what she wears. Moving ahead to 2013, Beyonce came back to steal the show after giving birth to her firstborn Blue Ivy with a strong and chic look that made her stand out from the swarm of dresses on the red carpet. This pantsuit paired with a bright red lip and slicked back pony was definitely a power move. Not to mention, she won the award for best R&B performance of the year with love on top. And clearly a bit of Blue Ivy love helped her take her over the edge with the look on the red carpet and on the stage. Now, this is one look we will never forget. J&B opened the 2014 Grammy Awards performing Drunk in Love, and Beyonce completely switched it up on us. This wet asymmetrical ombre bob and deep smoky eye took Beyonce's look to a whole new level. We happen to think our good friend Sir John had something to do with that. On the red carpet, she looked equally stunning, with the deep burgundy lip offsetting the beautiful white lacy dress and the draping earrings. Okay, so 2017 was an iconic year for Beyonce. On February 1st, she announced her twin pregnancy on Instagram, which racked up over 11 million likes, BT dubs, and only 12 days later, she performed at the Grammys with one of her most standout looks and performances of all time. She performed a medley of songs from her album Lemonade, plus took home the award for Best Contemporary R&B Album of the Year. I absolutely love these looks on Beyonce. Motherhood definitely suits her. Check out her Egyptian fertility goddess look on the stage with the halo. And on the red carpet, she's holding up the twin Grammys. She just looks stunning. I love it. And last but not least, at this year's Grammy weekend, Beyonce and Jay-Z went all out. With Jay-Z being nominated for eight awards this year, Beyonce gave us not one, but three beauty looks during the course of Grammy weekend. The first being at the Rock Nation brunch a day before the award show, where she pulled off this amazing look 
kind of looking like a dark angel with a high pony. Very fierce, I really love it. Next, the couple attended the Clive Davis pre-Grammy gala. Beyonce stepped out in a thought-provoking ensemble with beautiful waves and a smoky brown eye. I definitely think she's channeling some of the 80s vibes in this outfit. And on Grammy night, here it is. Beyonce wore gorgeous braids with this amazing hat and sunglasses. Can the queen do no wrong? The answer is no. For more of the latest and greatest in the world of beauty news, follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. And of course, subscribe to us on YouTube. Also, don't forget to check out full episodes of the American Beauty Star series at AmericanBeautyStar.com and Roku.